Hey guys, we're back and we're going ahead uh hang out with Warren, give him his flash drive back like it's that important. So don't uh -oh. think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. You can't fool Gotta me. Gotta collect them all. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. Can I do both? Could take a photo and intervene. Yeah. I? Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. Oh, fuck. Uh oh. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That asshole was so over the line. I could rewind and try something different. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. Don't bring out I'm the doing B word. My job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. <laughs> was that a... Do you think that was a, a telltale reference? Maybe. Oh, uh, Max, that was great. He would have said I'll remember that. I think that. you scared him for once. Yeah. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. Maybe Quite I should fashion. rewind and mind my own business? Nah. Oh, yeah. You know, this I'm whole... glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people being bullied. Um, the whole rewinding time power. Mm -hmm. It <clears throat> at least it's a girl main character. Because if it was a boy, none of this would make sense. Because there's only one thing that a teenage boy would do with rewind power. He'd go around grabbing girls' boobs and then rewinding, so there's no con consequences. Do you think only boys would do that? Okay, and, and some perverted girls, but we can just assume <laughs> that this one isn't completely perverted. Yeah. There's no way I can walk to the town from here. Damn it. Besides, I need to see Warren. I don't get it. How could Zack and Victoria do that to me? <coughs> <coughs> but, see? Hell yeah. <laughs> it's true. Hell yeah, see? Anybody, any guy who tells you that they wouldn't do that is fucking lying. And no consequences. Not only no consequences for you, but for the per the person that yeah, you've totally. grabbed either, because they'll never that never happened. But we still have the memory, so you still have the memory, but they never had the trauma of having yeah. to have you grab their any part of them. <laughs> Eat shit and smoke hippies. I better go there soon to see if Joyce is still there, and get a burger. I would walk in the wrong locker room. <laughs> <laughs> Cars equal death. Good thing I don't have a car. Yet. <laughs> I would go around taking money from people's pockets, rewinding and do it again. <laughs> <laughs> that kind of defeats this whole no consequences. Uh, funny. Who toilet paper's a bike? <clears throat> Take toilet paper. Take toilet paper. I would expensive. eat a burger so I could rewind and eat the burger again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but in this, the way this power works is you keep the things that you took. So you that that's burger. That's just eating two burgers. That's just eating two burgers. <laughs> You're still getting twice as fat. Oh fuck! Groundhog Day was on the other day, on TV, but it was on a channel we don't get. I Groundhog was so Day. Pissed. I want to see it again. The whole town is turning into one giant missing persons poster. It really is. See, Groundhog Day, 
everybody, like, you know, you'd want to do all the things Bill Murray does, but I would be terrified the entire time that this is going to be the one time that... That it sticks. It sticks. Yep. Now this really pisses me off. So entitled. Who the... Sorry, handicapped folks. My truck needs these two spots more than you do. Who is... Bastard. I have no idea. Do you think it's Prescott's and he drives this, like, all entitled? Or, I mean, um, ironically. Yeah, maybe. Or the security guy. Damn, somebody is seriously devoted to putting up these posters. Uh. Pile Janitor? of MPP? Missing oh, missing persons persons. posters. Yeah, maybe. We're really fucking with Warren here. He's been waiting for us for like. I hope he sees this. Hours. I hope he's watching right now. <laughs> what? <gasps> Puppy? What's oh no, he's okay. He's just sleeping. That dog looks peaceful asleep, but if I get too close, Cujo. What's Cujo? Ah! The scary dog movie. Really? Yeah. I never saw it. You basically it. don't need to see it now. I never even knew about it. Oh. It came out in what, like the 80s? Huh. Come on over here. Stephen Please. King. Oh, fuck off, Warren. <coughs> Too bad those posters will be trashed and ignored. Max, get your ass over here. We gotta check everything, Warren. Guy who downloads things for me. Juliet still looks upset about Zach and Victoria. I don't blame her. Hi, Juliet. How are you doing? Oh, hey, Max. Sorry, I'm still screwed up. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. Or anyway. Better sooner than later. Now that skank Victoria won't be laughing behind my back anymore. Have you talked to Zach yet? Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexted Victoria as a joke. Ha ha. I think Warren wants your attention. He usually does. Hang in there, Juliet. See you around, Max. I feel like hers is the same voice actress as the girl with the purple hair. Yeah, but the girl with purple hair has Just, like cotton in her mouth when she yeah. speaks. But besides that, I think it's the same person. I wonder how long before Samuel has to repaint that. Tard. Oh, retarded. Instead of reserved. Re. Oh. <laughs> No, that one's over there. Yeah, <laughs> it's definitely a slower vehicle. Yo, Max, check it out. <laughs> this is his car. Well, I do have to say that is the Looks best. Like a rabbit. That's that's the kind of car you want when you're in Max, high school because that's fucking badass. Yeah. Look at Warren in his wayback machine. He's a brave man. This is the perfect high school car. Yep. And there's Warren. Did he actually buy a used car? Um, or a celebrity like you had. Oh. It's got to be bad. Yeah. Either yeah. like Check it out. a boat like you had, or yeah. something so small that everybody has to like cram in. What up, Max? How are you? <coughs> Flash. Thanks. Oh. No problem. Check out my he went in for the hug? Yeah. Cool. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. How is that even serviceable? 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I bet. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. 
shit. Could have made money. <laughs> really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Meta? Had I known that. Wait, this wasn't anyway, a Kickstarter. Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. By the way, I saw Daniel's sketch of you online. Not bad, but I could do a much better job. Are you like the wrap up my choices guy? Mm, maybe. We already saw that Daniel posted it online. Daniel but I don't want to ask if he can draw. I don't want to like, nice. get personal. Uh, Congrats. You're part of his online portrait posse. Don't be jealous. I'm sure he'll ask you soon. Oh, you're a wit, Max. It's the company I keep, Warren. So did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? No, I've been way too busy with class and life. Damn, girl, you had it like a year. For a week, I did browse through all the titles, Drama Queen. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Okay, creep. No fucking way will I watch that. My mind is twisted enough. I laughed my ass off. So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. Why would I say this? Yeah. No, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white, plus babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. Uh, damn it. <laughs> <coughs> I don't want to speak about it. This is kind of a crazy day for me. I mean, I literally think I'm going crazy. I may be a pest, but I'm a good listener. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream from my so vagina. real it was like a movie? <laughs> oh, God. Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal now. Answer me, bitch. I told him the truth. A student had a gun. No. You told him I had a gun. That's why he dragged me into his office. And did what, give you a stern lecture? Nobody, nobody lectures me. Everyone tries though, <laughs> they try. You should talk to somebody, Nathan. Do not analyze me. I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Uh, my name is actually Max Caulfield or was he making a catch in the riot reference? No, that's our name. Oh. So you think that this is a reference to Catcher in the Rap, that her name is that? I don't know. Yeah, I feel like the cult, anytime you whip out Caulfield, you're making a... Maybe. A nod to... Probably Holden. it's a nod, I can see it. Um, she kind of acts like Holden, I guess. Eh. Yeah, she's got... Same age, same time in her life, same angst-ish. Yeah. I was gonna say, she's got some angst, but... Misdirection, yeah. Not, not holding. Feel like she's like. fitting in. She's not rich though. Yeah. It was never quite clear whether Holden was rich though. He was well, out. Well, he had money to get around. Yeah, that's true. Take Felt a like step it came back. from like his uncle. Anyways, yeah. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh man, you're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude. <laughs> Leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore right in the bathroom! <gasps> Max? Chloe? No That's way. Chloe! You again? That's Chloe! She changed. Stand, Max. Oh, wait, no. So she's the entitled Get prick. Yeah. <laughs> there now. That's Don't a pretty awesome run. vehicle for her. Yeah. <laughs> 
So I knew it was her because I had looked up the characters. But at that point in time, we weren't supposed to know. So that's why I was telling you not to look at the chat. Somebody spoiled that? Well, they were saying you met, him. You met her already. And that's dangerous. Spoiler. <laughs> this day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Uh... I have no idea. I know he's a press card. And an asshole. Your friend really stood up for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt, and you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? <coughs> uh, oh man, we like it. I guess. It was cool, but I felt kind of lonely, out of my league. I would He's think I'd fit right in now. with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. At least you're still a smartass. That's why I'm here. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. They have almost the exact same face. If you... Yeah. If you get rid of the, like, hair and everything. Like, look at their features. The nose and the lips and the eyes. And all she the, has almost freckles. the exact same. Yeah, and the, get rid of the freckles. Uh... Oh, I'm not saying that. No. <laughs> of course, it's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. Oh, God, yes. Uh. So come back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. Yeah, what the fuck was that all about? Phones work two ways, bitch. I'm sorry. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. Yeah, what the fuck? I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Are those real tats? At 18? Like a full-on sleeve? Shit. How was your home life? It's either really good or really bad. I was just gonna say that. <laughs> what? Oh, it's like we disappeared. We are in her mind the whole time. Man, are you serious? <laughs> wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. Just rewind. My step douche has a boatload of tools. That's Maybe all Polaroids do. I need very I pretend they're pooping. tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. Aww, boy. Cool. Now we're gonna run a gang. Ooh. Guess we're gonna have to get some tattoos. And start calling them tatties. Come on in, don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home, shit, home. All right, we'll come back. Meanwhile. And when we're back, we're gonna hang out with the cool girls. Stay tuned.